Jackson and Deborah on air to ground two. We do have TCS as the prime sensor now, and uh, it does seem to be matching well with HHL. Shuttle Commander George Zamka calling down to Mission Control to provide some information about the TCS, the trajectory control sensor, that that seems to be providing accurate uh, information about uh, Endeavour's position relative to the International Space Station and matching up with the handheld laser. That uh, sensor did not uh, work properly during Endeavour's arrival and docking to the space station. Endeavour, Houston, air to ground two, back with you, uh, Zambo. We did copy your call about HHL and TCS. Also, uh, we'd like uh, for you to... Copy, Houston, I uh, got you loud and clear. Okay, loud and clear also. We'd also like you to uh, check uh, on panel A7L uh, if the PB power off got performed to the docking system. Endeavor, uh, we've got that done now. Thanks for the backup. We see it, Endeavor. Thanks a lot. Looks great. Endeavor, Houston, uh, we just came into the KU band. Uh, we could come on, on board if you still have your flight deck camcorder, or we could just go for the uh, outside view and wait for the sun to come up. Okay, Houston, Endeavor, you are welcome on board. Stevie Ray's got the camcorder uh, set up for, uh, for our ops on the flight deck. We will take that view and move it to the window uh, as we approach the fly around point. Sounds good. Uh, Inco is going to bring us on board. Thank you. Endeavor Houston, now for Stevie Ray on air to ground two. You can just make sure we're set up to come on board uh, analog to the flight deck. Uh, yeah, we had that uh, cable strung out into the window. We're going to bring it back now, and uh, that way you can come on board. That sounds great. Uh, we just see a good uh, video now from the flight deck. Uh, we sure do appreciate that. Glad to have you on board with us. This is a live view on the aft flight deck of the Space Shuttle Endeavour. Pilot Terry Burtz on the left, flying Endeavour away from the International Space Station now at a distance of 223 feet. Astronaut K higher on the right, holding the handheld laser to monitor that distance and increase of distance. And just to let you know the plan, when the sun comes up here in a few minutes, we're just going to switch our view over to the centerline camera and watch that view. So you don't need to reconfigure your camera. Uh, unless you need it to record the HD views uh, out the window. Okay, 
Okay, CJ, copy. Thanks, uh, thanks for that. We will take the camera and, and try to get that HD view. Uh, we appreciate that flexibility, though. And uh, uh, if there's something that you uh, request, let us know. We'll uh, put it in the queue and try to get it down to you. Yep, we're enjoying the show right now, Endeavor. And uh, when the sun comes up, then uh, you can just go ahead and uh, reconfigure your camera to capture that HD video. In fact, a few minutes prior, if you want, that'll be uh, great just see if you want to catch the sunrise or anything. Yeah, CJ, that would be a great call. If you can give us a five minutes prior to uh, the sun up, that way we'd, uh, we'd move the camera at that time. We're at four and a half minutes now, so uh, we're ready for you to do that anytime. Uh, we got some great shots of uh, Terry flying the Space Shuttle Endeavor. Excellent. Okay, we'll move it over. Endeavour's Commander George Ziemka communicating with astronaut Rick Sterko here in Mission Control. Coordinating uh, the glimpse uh, on board the flight deck of the Space Shuttle Endeavour during its uh, departure from the space station, now 262 feet away. Endeavour's pilot uh, Terry Wirtz at the controls. Mission specialists Kay Heyer and Steve Robinson also in view. As the Space Shuttle Endeavour is about to cross over into an orbital sunrise over uh, Russia and Kazakhstan, the uh, view will be switched to the camera looking at the International Space Station for the uh, fly around of the spacecraft. The crew members now setting up the camera in the overhead window on board Endeavour to look at the International Space Station, now 364 feet away. Just a couple minutes away from orbital sunrise to shed uh, more light on the International Space Station. The sun coming up on the International Space Station in this view provided by a video camera on board the Space Shuttle Endeavour, just about 400 feet away from the complex. 
the shadow of the Space Shuttle Endeavour visible on the uh, solar ray wing to the left. Endeavor Houston, we see you in the fly around, and we got to uh, watch a great sunrise with the shadow of the shuttle uh, on the space station. We would uh, like to verify your recording on board, and then we're going to go ahead and switch over to the uh, centerline camera view down here. Okay, CJ, copy. Thanks for that. We see a red dot in the uh, in the G1, and uh, we're ready for you to switch to centerline uh, when you're ready. Endeavour's pilot. Endeavour, and it looks great. Thank you very much. Endeavour's pilot Terry Burtz has begun the fly around of the International Space Station at a distance of about uh, 425 feet now. This view is from the camera set up in the uh, common berthing, the uh, orbiter docking system that uh, was attached to the International Space Station. Endeavour's pilot Terry Burtz uh, will be flying in the uh, orbiter in a fly around uh, of the space station, providing a view of the new configuration of the complex.